Sports. And on camp tonight, it's the Dallas Mavericks going up against the Oklahoma City Thunder. Alongside Doris Burke and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. And on the sidelines, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. So here's Oklahoma City's starting group. We've got Lou Dort. Williams is out there with Holdren. Then there's Shane Gilgis Alexander. And it's Joe in at the two spot. And for Dallas, we've got Irving. Daniel Gafford is out there with Washington. Then it's Jones. And it's Doncic in at the point guard. So Dallas will get the first possession. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. First what you love foul. about Luka Doncic is this foul. unique combination of size and Dallas. skill. He could really Luka play cross Dallas. positionally. He makes shots at two. all three levels. So dangerous. Oh, take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He misses the free throw. Good on the second free throw. Now the thunder with it. it loose Washington with it he's picked up by Gilgis Alexander they get the rebound a double clutch and it's laid up and in by Washington oh what a mid-air adjustment you know he had to alter his release point but didn't let it throw off the shot now let's go to David Aldridge who spoke with Mark Gagnon David as they sit on the brink of elimination Asked him if he sensed any nerves in the locker room. He assured me that no matter the situation, he's got a group of guys that are up for the challenge. He thinks that they have an advantage in talent, and if they play with passion, they're going to send this back to a game seven. Let's see if he's right, Kevin. Back to you. Thank you, David. Doncic against Dort releases, and Doncic gets it to go. Uh, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. Gilgis Alexander passes to Dort. The shot's good. Gilgis Alexander making the play. You can see the work Lou Dort has put in to make himself a threat from three. That's a pretty looking shot right there. Here's Doncic. Somehow ignores the tight D and gets the way. Doncic has got five points so far. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. First person to foul. First, first trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Shooting for Oklahoma City. Shane Gilgis comes in. At the line for two. makes the first. I think what you love about Shea Gilgis Alexander is the size, athleticism, and instincts he brings to the position. This guy has the whole package. Both good from the line that time. This is about the last guy you want to send to the stripe right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. The pass to Gaffer. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by. Doncic against Dort. Rocket six. Good D by Gildas Alexander.
The kick out to Williams. And it goes out of bounds. That one off George. Here's a peek at the 2K leaderboard with a list of the top rebounders in this year's playoffs. Luka Doncic fourth. He's dialed up his rebounding here in the postseason. There's something about the big games that bring out the best in him. Makes it off the glass. Doncic has got his third basket of the night right there. And Gilgis Alexander's got the ball here for Oklahoma City. Trailing by two. Thursday's loss was a disappointment. Scoring efficiency was an issue in that one. Took them too many shots to get their point. I think it was a lot of bad decisions leading to a lot of poor looks. Patience was not their best quality in that basketball game. And here's Doncic from the arc. Drills it from outside. Doncic has got 10 points in the game. I'll tell you, this lead's not going anywhere with this guy making plays. What a point. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Thunder. And sometimes from the outside, not always clear what led a coach to call for a timeout. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed. Got a piece of it. Out of bounds. It'll be Maverick's ball. And the Mavericks with possession here. Leading by five. Irving looking over the floor. Down low. Here's Gafford. Yes! And it's Irving picking up the assist. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this one. Joe passes to Gilgis Alexander. Over Jones. The shot's good from Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander getting to the in-between game, taking what the defense gives him. Andrzej's outside. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. About five of six to start. Looks like he brought his A game. The Mavericks have shot two free throws, and they're one of two so far. That's his second personal, second team foul. At the line for Dallas, Luka Doncic. At the line for one. Trailing by eight. Here's Joe. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. First person to foul. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. And a closer look here at the scoring right there for the Mavericks. I like how they've worked the ball inside, getting looks closer in there, and that really helps your offense. Another big component of their early game tonight has been points off turnovers. Great job converting on those chances. The first free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. Mavericks leading by six. Doncic feeling it out. Gafford trying to break free. Doncic no good. Thunder have gone three of five shooting the ball so far. And it's slammed in by Williams. Well, a great decision from Dort. If your teammate is open, get him the basketball. Nicely done. For Dallas, they've gotten seven of their first ten attempts to fall so far. Excellent pace to their offense. Doncic against Dort. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. And then Jones with the jam. 
Make no mistake, guys, the playmaking ability of Luka Doncic is special. Even at a young age, this guy can pick apart a defense. Gilgis Alexander against Jones. Here's Jones. Hits the three-point bomb. Joe's got seven. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Dort against Dungeon. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Here's Joe. He has seven. And the rejection by Keffer. Basket counts. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Pass the gap. And there's the call on Chet Holmgren. That's his third foul of the game. Ouch. Three fouls for him already. And now if you're the coach, you got to think about sitting him down. And looking at that replay again, just a big time block right there. And well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now the defense is in overdrive. Here's Doncic. That's the sixth make from the field. He's taken nine shots and missed but three. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Now, Hilgis Alexander. Up and in, off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Well, let's remember that at six foot six, Shea Gilgis Alexander can more than handle himself near the cup. It's stolen by Dort. The shot by Williams, no good. And the activity he shows around the rim is why he is such a respected defender. And what you love about his work defensively, the ability to challenge and change shots without fouling. Oklahoma City's gone two or three from Butte so far in this game. Dort and trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Dallas has gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Here's Holmgren. And the jump by Holmgren. That's a double whammy, guys. <laughs> That's right. A great defensive play. Then the emphatic stuff. Uh, let's see if that serves as a momentum builder. What a great sequence for this group. And it'll be the Mavericks with their first time out here of the game. Lippers come out on the floor, everyone. It's time to get ready. Turn it loud for your D-Town crew. Another round of applause for your junior D-Town crew. Washington finds Doncic. Dort grabs the miss. Thunder have gone 8 of 14 from the field in the first quarter. Here's Williams. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. First personal foul. Third team foul. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Thunder. Oh, man. How about the mid-range jumper from these guys? It's on tonight. A huge part of their offense so far. And they've also shown dominance in the paint so far tonight. Really putting the work in down low. And the first one drops. Drops them both. And so here is Dallas. It's a three-point game. Dort against Doncic. Takes the three. And Holmgren pulls it down. And right from the start, Kevin, they've been pounding the glass. Most of those 50-50 balls also going in. The shot's good from Gilgis Alexander. 
pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Not sure Kyrie Irving gets enough credit for how good he is from three-point territory. He is elite from deep. Inside, and it's Williams finishing it off. How good a playmaker are we watching? Always leading, always trying to create for others. Green inside. He'll just Alexander cover it. Green, no luck. Dort with the ball. He takes it in. And the dunk to finish it off. A ah, beauty. Well, Luke Dort off the deck. That powerful frame on the drive. Don't mess with him, boy. Doncic against Dort. Here's Doncic. Defense is right there. That's in. He's 7 for 12 now in the game. Well, this quarter has been all about this guy. He is trying to close the gap in the score. Now a timeout called by Oklahoma City. Time to make some noise for your defense crew. Jim Hardaway Jr. has checked in for the Mavericks. And Oklahoma City making a change here. The Thunder leading by four. Outside Williams. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. A three-pointer off the mark. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. He kicks it to Hardaway. That shot off. Good D by Gilgis Alexander. And that one gives them a plus five rebound advantage, Kevin. Williams. He's off on that one. So the Mavericks will take it the other way. Washington with it. He's picked up by Gilgis Alexander. And here's Doncic from the arc. Wiggins with the rebound. Just enough coverage to bother that three-point attack. And it's Williams finishing it off. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. Doncic kicks to Hardaway. Tipped away. Gilgis Alexander with the steal. Trying to get open is Giddy. Gilgis Alexander, good. Gilgis Alexander's got 10. I don't know what's happening defensively, but they're not putting up any resistance. Here's Green. Williams with the block. And they get it back to the left wing from deep Washington. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. And offensively right now, each team getting what it wants. Yeah, this is already a high-scoring game, but we knew that was a possibility coming into this run. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Jump ball call. And it's the Thunder with the ball. Hard away against Giddy. Knocked away. And Williams with the clear path to the hoop. And there it is for him. Ten points for him. I'll tell you, this guy is proving to be a problem for the defense. In this quarter, he has been special. Green inside the three-point line. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. Mavericks trailed by five. Wiggins with the rebound. Over Hardaway. Nice spin off the left rim and in. And so it's Oklahoma City headed to the bench with a seven-point lead as we wrap up the quarter. They're playing a bruising game inside, and it's working for them. Back right after this. And we 
welcome you back to 2K Sports coverage of the Western Conference semifinals. What stands out to you from Oklahoma City in this one? Yeah, in that first period, they look to push in transition at every opportunity. And why wouldn't they? You see their effectiveness in the open floor. Very difficult to slow down. On the floor for Oklahoma City getting going here in the second quarter. Josh Giddy is out there with Wallace. And it's Hayward. Then it's Williams. And it's Williams at the force. Mavericks trailed by seven. By the way, that's a two-pointer. A quick look, no good that time. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. No question, he got off on that shot. First Oklahoma team. City shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. Williams, two shots. And the first one at the line is good for the Thunder. Holmgren comes in for Williams. And it's Dort in for Josh Giddy. And Williams drops them both. Dallas has gone three to six tonight when they've let it fly from downtown. Irving passes to Hardaway. Jones looking for an opening. Outside Irving. Just four to shoot. And the three off target. And, the, and they're controlling the boards, Kevin. That's plus five in that category. Here's Hayward. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. And it's Jones with the ball for the Dallas Mavericks. They trail by nine points. Wow. And that's, it's close, but they're tipping it on balance team quick team. enough. And the Thunder making a switch here. Joe's checked in. Isaiah Joe. Just over a minute gone here in the second quarter. And he makes that one. Kyrie Irving is elite. Finishing on the interior. Don't let the size fool you. That's to Joe. Here is Hayward. And no good. Left side, Irving. And that comes off the assist by Joe. Irving's got four points this quarter. Well, you get exactly what you want right there. Clean look right at the cup. Nicely done. Pope loose. It's Dort on the wing. Off target with his three. Mavericks trailed by five. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. Here's Hardaway. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First foul. It's proving very Second difficult to guard Tim Hardaway Jr. without fouling the guy, especially Tim when he's Hardaway this aggressive. Jr. The Mavericks shooting their fourth shot. and fifth shots at the foul line in the game. And that one misses. You see, to me, guys, for Tim Hardaway Jr., there's still another level for him to reach. He has proven that he can be a big-time scorer. To me now, it's about consistency and doing it night after night after night. And the second free throw, good. Now here's Wallace. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Kicks it to Holmgren. And there's the pass to Joe. Over Irving. And again, Oklahoma City. No good. 
Mavericks trailed by four. Outside Hardaway. The shot, no good. Nice defense from Holt. Well, Thunder have gotten off to a rough start here in the second quarter. 0 for 5. Passes to Joe. Fires it up. And again, Oklahoma City, no good. The Mavericks have gone 2 of 5 from the field here in the second quarter, shooting 40%. Exum dishes to Hardaway. Nice defense from Dort. Oklahoma City leading by four on the wing. Wallace. It's stolen by Jones. To the inside. Here's Exum. And finished off by Exum. That's a stunning punch, guys. Mm. Turn it over and give him a free run to the bucket. Oh, you're so right. No question who has the momentum now. It's still close, though. These teams have been neck and neck. Let's see the response here. Time called here. The Thunder decide to talk it over. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. Well, night in and night out, sometimes it's a battle of runs. Who has the most? the second quarter of action as we approach four minutes played to stop the drought and it's sent back by Irving don't tell me Kyrie Irving can't play defense send it back high Gafford trying to break free the score now all even yeah they're going to have a nice little run here the Thunder shooting 48 percent from the field not bad at all Wallace looking for an opening. It's stolen by Jones. Pass to Hardaway. Dishes to Exit. Pass to Jones. Six to shoot. And here's Exit. And that won't go, missing the go-ahead bucket. Wallace against Hardaway. Tim and the foul Hardaway called Jr. on Tim Hardaway Jr. That is his first foul of the game. Mavericks making a switch here. Doncic is checked in. And Oklahoma City with a change here too. Shea Gilgis Alexander checked in for Wallace. Hayward against Hardaway. And it's Hayward. Hayward. Time on the assist by the Gilgis assist. Alexander. Shea Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got three assists tonight. Dallas has gone 0-2 from deep here in the center. And there's the call yeah. on Lou Dort. First personal foul. That's his first foul. 13 foul. I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. Here's Doncic. He's got 17. There's the pass to Irving. Back to Jones. Outside Hardaway. Four on the clock. Shoots over Gilgis Alexander. And it's Dallas with another. Well, in today's NBA, you've got to be able to play in pick and roll. And Hardaway doing work right there. Here's Gilgis Alexander. That's him. That's his fifth field goal. He's shooting a hot 71%. Five for seven. And so it's Dallas with him. Only giving up six here in this quarter. Here's Doncic. Here's Irving. He can't get that one to fall. Good D by Gildas Alexander. And Gildas Alexander's got the ball here for the Thunder. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Jones Jr. Tremendous length at the guard spot that Shea Gildas Alexander presents is a problem for a lot of defensive players. He's gone two for two at the line so far. That's 
good from Gilgis Alexander. And they have yet to miss a shot from the line here this quarter. Gilgis Alexander hits them both. Mavericks trailed by four. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Passes it to Hardaway. Shoots the three. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Hardaway has got his third basket of the night. Well, a tough first quarter for this guy. You'd like to see a shot go in. Nicely done. It's stolen by Jones. In the corner, Irving with it. And good, and it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Irving's got six here in this quarter. It's a neck-and-neck -neck game here in Dallas. Here's Joe. He has seven. He kicks to Holmgren. Six on the shot clock. Here's Gilgis Alexander. The Thunder with another miss. Normally he'll drill that shot, and I'm, I'm sure they'll look to find him in that spot again. Well, no doubt. Very good play call, good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. Here's Hayward. Count the bucket coming what? off a perfectly Hayward. placed assist. And the Thunder lead by one. Boy, pure strength from Hayward. Loves overcoming any challenge a defender might throw his way. Here's Doncic. Eight for 15 with that made basket, but he's not satisfied yet. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Hayward outside. Over Hardaway. Hayward can hit. Dallas has gotten fewer than half of their three-pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. Outside Irving. The offensive rebound. Gafford. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Second personal foul. That one on Dort. And I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. First trip to the line for him here. First one falls. Gafford cans them both. Here's Gilgis Alexander. 14 points for him. Outside Williams. On the wing, Giddy. Floats it up for Williams. The alley of Williams. Very well done. Assist from yeah, it's just incredible Josh court Giddey. awareness by Josh Giddy. Understanding wide open man, I've got to find him. Here's Irving. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Pressured that shot by getting a hand up just as good as a block. And he did it without fouling. And that's become an art. Changing shots without making contact. Stockship against Gilgis Alexander. No good on that one. Now the Mavericks take it the other way. Green the pass to Doncic. Here's Irving. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Doncic has got three assists in the game. Williams looking around. It's rebounded by Dallas. Gafford's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Some nice passing here by Dallas. And what an alley-oop. Those two read each other so well. It's a play I'm sure they love to run. 
Gilgis Alexander against Irving. Shoots it up. And he gets the friendly Gee, spin Gilgis and that one drops. Gilgis Alexander's got six in the quarter. This guy's showing off his entire offensive package right now. Shake Gilgis Alexander in full effect. And that one's good. Green. Now, Gilgis Alexander. 16 points for him. Pass to Williams. He dishes it to Wiggins. That's his second shot and his second basket. He's two for two. And despite the hot start from beyond, they've gotten away from shooting the triple. Pass to Gaffer. Over Williams. Again, the Mavericks score. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Gafford against Gilgis Alexander. Can't hit it to fall. Mavericks leading by five. Anjic passes to Gafford. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. First personal foul. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Daniel Gafford at the line for two. One is off. P.J. Washington, he's checked in for Doncic. And he misses the second one as well, so he is 0 for 2 that time. And with their struggles at the line this quarter, that free throw percentage has dropped down to about 55%. That's not going to get a point. And Giddy gets it to go. Giddy. Now, this is Three. going to help Josh Giddy's game. Boy, the confidence will rise if he can make these catch and shoot opportunities. Green kicks to Washington. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Green's got three assists tonight. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. It's Wiggins at the top of the key. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Kicks it out to Wiggins. And the Thunder, another three. That's the kind of D that you're not going to find success with, guys. They've got to get a hand in the face. Green passes to Washington. Irving with the ball. Shoots over Gilgis Sherwin. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. This guy has been a catalyst for them all game long. What a job leading them to this lead. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Washington with it. Eight points for him. Irving from long range. Got his hand out enough on that one to bother the three-point attempt. Great hustle on that one. You know, we talk about this time and time again. Trying to stay connected to shooters along the perimeter. Nicely done. And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Mavericks lead by four. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks, Kevin. Jason, a hard-fought first half. How do you assess the game so far? We're going to need everybody. And the one thing we got to do is we can't settle. We got to keep attacking and get the ball in the paint. Use that length to your advantage. Thanks, Jason. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks, David. And we'll be back shortly following halftime to get the third quarter underway. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. So one half completed in this round two conference semifinal game. Ernie Johnson with Shaq and Kenny the Jet. 
We'll be breaking down all the action. Well, for the Mavericks, they're locked in a battle tonight. And knowing that they're desperate to clinch the series here in Game 6, it's likely to be a rough, grinded-out second half. They don't want to let this opportunity get away from them. And from what we saw so far from the Mavericks, Kenny, what's your takeaway? Well, I like what I'm seeing on the offensive end. They're keeping things simple, getting to their spots and executing. Nothing fancy. Kind of like Shaq Sue. And now, Shaq, let's get your opinion on Oklahoma City. They were strong in transition. Seemed like the guys fed off the higher tempo. Certainly, they definitely got the looks they wanted to play in an outstanding game. They can keep it up in the second half. They may wear the other side out. And it's just about time now for the third quarter to get underway. for 2K Sports coverage of Game 6. You know, Luka Doncic has been exceptional here, guys. And, and you know he's going to put up points every time out, but, boy, he made it look so easy in that first half. Now, let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. They've got Washington... Irving is out there with Luka Doncic. Then it's Jones. That's the five to begin the second half for Jason Kidd. Here's Gilgis Alexander in for his seventh pick in 14 tries. Well, pick and roll play from Shea Gilgis Alexander really starting to come along. Doncic against Dort. Tipped. Just five on the clock. The three for Doncic. Thunder with the rebound. Gilgis Alexander's got four rebounds in this game. Dort passes to Joe. Now Gilgis Alexander. Over Jones. Oh, and the officials will call the illegal screen right there. And those are the kinds of mistakes that are magnified when we're talking about a game down the stretch. And the replay demonstrating once again how aggressive that defense was. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. Daniel Gafford's checked in for the Mavericks. The Mavericks should be one of the high points for them in this game at 54%. No one near Doncic as he lets it fly. And it's off from three-point range. And it's Williams with the ball for the Oklahoma City Thunder. They haven't given up any points here in the second half. Here's Joe. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Doncic with it. Dort covering. They get it again. Kicks it out to Jones. Dallas moving it around. And on the way from Irving for three. Wow, Shake Gilgis Alexander, Alexander off his feet and Joe. sends it back. Second personal foul. First team foul. Third quarter of play with just over a minute and a half gone by. And another shot. Irving. And oh, oh boy, a lot of contact there. But he gets the call and will shoot two. Of one on Holmgren. Second you know, team Irving foul. isn't just a perimeter player. He's so dynamic inside as a scorer. His strength is savvy. Tough to keep the defense on balance. The Mavericks have shot just above 55% of the line going five of nine. That's good from Irving. This guy is an absolutely electric talent. Can completely take over a game. Kyrie Irving able to be a facilitator, a scorer, and we know he doesn't duck the big moments. And so he hits both. 
Oklahoma City trailing. Here's Joe. He's got seven. Rebounded by Gafford. Gafford's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Irving. Rebounded by Joe. Ouch. Five shots without a make. That's a really ragged start. Coming out of that. The pass to Gilgis Alexander. Passes it to Holmgren. On the wing, Williams. Just five to shoot. Misses the J after tricking the D with the nifty pass there. Right side, Jones. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. To the middle. The kick out to Irving. Good on the three-point shot. Irving's got five points now this quarter. First three of the half. Second of the game. Can he beat up? Joe passes to Gilgis Alexander. And he finishes it off with a one-handed jam. So smooth, so pretty off the dribble drive. Shea Gilgis Alexander doing work. And the Mavericks call time here. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Well, this is a chess match. Looking ahead a few moves and trying to execute toward that. Let's hear it one more time for your favorite dance team. Here's Irving. He's got 18. Bruce. Oklahoma City foul. Isaiah Jett. Third personal foul. Third team foul. Dort against Doncic. Irving from long range. And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got assist number five here tonight. Challenging this day with a three ball. That's his second from distance this half. And he also hit one in the first half, too. Joe Good. Joe's got nine points. Second half here. We're just over three and a half minutes into it. Irving kicks to Washington. On the wing, Doncic over towards a new 14 for the Mavericks. And Gafford throws it down. That is a product of pure effort, guys. I agree, and that's nothing new coming from him, GA. He loves going to work on the rebounding, going to work on the board. What about the decisive finish? Great timing, tremendous force. Under trailing by six. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. Basket good. Gilgis, Gilgis Alexander's got eight points in the quarter. He has not missed a shot in this quarter. They've tried running different things in him, but he's been unstoppable. Anjic passes to Jones. Pass to Irving for three. Out to Doncic. And he's going up for the alley-oop. Now, here's Dort. He's got five. Holmgren gets the bucket. Holmgren. Six points for him. Just no resistance inside at all. They are feasting. This is a straight buffet. It is. It's a big one. They load the plate. Outside, Jones. He gets it in there. And the Mavericks lead by four. The Thunder have gone six of ten from the field in the third quarter. On the wing, the shot's good from Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got ten points in just the second half. Doncic against Dort. Kicks it out to Jones. And here's Washington outside. And it's Shea Gilgis Alexander with the rebound. Gilgis Alexander's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Williams gets the bucket. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. No, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for. Consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Here's Doncic. 
And the rebound goes to the Thunder. I think he's got to settle down because right now it feels like he's rushing, like he's forcing some shots. This quarter he has been completely bothered. So they take the lead. Dort. Dort's got seven points in the game. Listen, that is all you can do defensively. Luke Dort at times is just going to make tough shots. Doncic against Dort. From deep Washington. And that comes off the assist by Jones. Jones has got six assists now in the game. Washington against Williams. Can't hit that one. Now Dallas takes it the other way. Washington passes to Doncic. From downtown. And it's Shea Gilgis Alexander with the rebound. Gilgis Alexander's got six rebounds in the game. And it's sent back by Irving. Now, here's Washington. Tight defense on him. This one for three. A put that controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And the Mavericks lead by three. And a closer look here at the hustle stance for the Mavericks. Great job by this team closing out. Locking up a bunch of shots and just a tremendous effort defensively. The other thing that jumps out about their performance tonight, the amount of steals really pressuring those ball handlers. Now a timeout called by Oklahoma City. Get out of your seat! Get out of your feet! Higgins is checked in for Oklahoma City. Substitution on the court. Now the pass to Williams. Outside, George. Oklahoma City gets it back. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Second personal foul. First For Oklahoma foul. City, they haven't made a mistake at the and line yet. Defender. Ten of ten. Williams. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. That one misses. The Mavericks leading. Jits outside. Maverick foul. Number two. First personal foul. First team foul. And so it's Dort with it. He brings it up for the Oklahoma City Thunder. Williams, that's a two-pointer. Mavericks with the rebound. Here's Hardaway, and Holmgren pulls it down. Holmgren's got rebound number eight now on the night. Here's Gilgis Alexander. They get it back. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one in the strike. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. No doubt those extra possessions can really add up against you when you do not take care of the defensive glass. And that drops, so they now lead by one. Way Greg, they're sharing the ball tonight, mesmerizing. Everyone's getting to touch it, and, and everyone's contributing. Passes it to Washington. Hardaway for three, and he's good on the three ball. 
Hardaway has got 11 points. Assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Gildas Alexander passes to Holmgren. And a great assist by Gildas Alexander as that one goes in. Gildas Alexander's got six assists now in the game. Moving against Wiggins. Nice catch and finish on the alley -oop. And the Mavericks lead by two. A really heads up play by Kyrie Irving on time and on target pass. We've seen that before. Unloads from 13. And there's another one for the Thunder. Just good aggressive drive from him that time. Found a hole in the D and went straight to the rim. And there's the call on Lou George. That's his fourth foul of the contest. Boy, plenty of time left in the clock. He needs to keep his poise. That's his fourth foul now. Green, he's checked in for the Mavericks. And then for Oklahoma City. Williams, he's checked in for Holmgren. And Josh Giddey's subbed in for George. Two Green, minutes pitch to Washington. Two minutes. Oklahoma City foul. Aaron He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots foul. of the game right here. Fifteen foul. At the line for Dallas, Kyrie Irving. At the line for two. And that one falls for Irving. Both free throws, good from Kyrie Irving. And not a single free throw attempt in that first half, but he has been far more active since the break and drawn some fouls. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points, so one free throw coming up. A little artistry in the painted area converting against the sides. Some guys just relish the challenge. Find a way, and he does. Mavericks making a switch here. Doncic has checked in. And that one falls for Williams. The Mavericks trail. Doncic outside. That's the three five. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Williams has got rebound number eight now on the night. Dallas foul. You play foul. Third personal foul. Fourth team foul. Again, a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach Taking for Oklahoma City. They bullied the defense here in the paint. Look at all of those buckets inside just hard to defend in the paint and they've also been scoring on the break with how difficult it is to get buckets in the half court anytime you can push the ball in transition for easy ones that's big time that's good from Williams Williams drops them both. Mavericks trailed by three. And here is Doncic. 19 points in the game. And the layup is good. Doncic is got 21. And not his quarter, scoring-wise. Just one of seven from the field. Still just Alexander passes to Williams. Kicks to Wiggins. It doesn't go for him. Great tee that time from Green. Outside Hardaway. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. 
First personal foul. That one on Gilgis Alexander. Well, this is a quick and decisive offensive player who's Tim not afraid of contact. Love Tim Hardaway Jr. Jr. accepting the contact. First one falls for Hardaway right away hits them both. And here's Gilgis Alexander. He'll bring it up for Oklahoma City. Let's remember, Shea Gilgis Alexander is six foot six, so getting on the interior is not a problem. So far, he's hit all of his shots at the foul line, going four for four. Two shots. That's good from Gilgis Alexander. Gilgis Alexander hits them both. The Mavericks shooting 39% from the floor since the half. Not really what they had in mind. At the teardrop, and Doncic finishes inside. <laughs> Doncic has got four this quarter. There is this fundamental confidence to what Luka does, and those difficult floaters, no problem. The shot's good from Gilgis Alexander. Well, you love that they've been able to rely on him time and time again. You love the effort here late. Doncic sinks that one from the post. Doncic has got 25 points. Listen, this is becoming routine for Luka Doncic. This guy's a big-time scorer who can take over when he's ready. Williams up on top. Off target from outside. And at the close of the third quarter, still a close game, and both teams putting up points in a hurry. The Mavericks on top. They lead by one. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter. And now let's go back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. And, and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Well, making the game easy for your teammates. All about putting them in a position to score. That's pretty. We've reached the fourth quarter, and what has been a very competitive game should be an exciting finish. And Oklahoma City, look at who they've got to start the fourth quarter. Williams is out there with Williams. Then there's Shane Gilgis Alexander. Then it's Josh Giddy. And it's Hayward in at the three, the small forward. Oklahoma City's gotten fewer than half of their three-pointers to go down tonight. They're four for nine. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Count it from 12. Gilgis Alexander's got 34 points. Time running low, guys, and uh, somebody has got to win this one. Yeah, well, who knows? We might need an overtime in this one. It's been that kind of a game. This guy is as difficult to cover as there is in the NBA. Kyrie Irving, the master at drawing contact. Kyrie Irving, two shots. And he knocks down the first one. And the Thunder making a change here. Joe's checked in. Oh. 
Both free throws. Good from Kyrie Irving. Oklahoma City trailing. Now Giddy. Pass to Joe. Puts it up. It's rebounded by Dallas. Green's got four rebounds in this game. Outside Hardaway. Over Giddy. And Hardaway gets it to go. And the Mavericks lead by three. Guys, you want to be able to score from all three levels. And Hardaway Jr. is capable. That instance, mid-range is on point. Pass to Williams. Hooked away. And it's out of bounds. The Thunder able to retain possession. Holmgren is checked in for Williams. Now into the lineup for the Thunder. Chet Holmgren. For three, Williams. Not going to go that time. And the Mavericks going the other way now. And the pass to Green. Dallas moving the ball around. And they're running. Williams with the ball. Jones covering. Offensive rebound. Out to Hayward. To the wing right side. Clock at four. No coverage that time. Assisted. Well, that's the IQ Gordon of Gordon Hayward. Hayward on display. He understands what the defense is trying to take away and finds the open man. Passes it to Green. It's good. You love how Eastside has risen to the challenge throughout this. I'll tell you, we have seen great execution from both teams. Neither one giving an inch here. Joe. Basket number five goes in. He's now five of 12 from the floor. And the D not really doing its job there. A little slow to react to the ball getting into the paint. Here's Hardaway. And two free throws coming up. Unable to get that one to go with all the contact. Second team foul. At the line for Dallas. Tim Hardaway Jr. At the line for two. Free throw good from Hardaway. Daniel Gafford's checked in for Josh Green. So he gets them both. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line this half. Jones against Gilgis Alexander. No good. Shot missing. Good work defensively by Jones. Irving kicks to Hardaway. The shot sends him to the line. Second personal foul. Third team foul. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Tim Hardaway Jr. Taking two shots. Free throw good from Hardaway. <laughs> 
And he makes the first, but misses the second. Well, it wasn't a perfect trip to the line, but it was good enough to stretch their lead to two possessions. Dort passes to Gilgis Alexander. They were trying to get open. And with that, the Maverick lead is cut down now to just two on the basket from Gilgis Alexander. Outside Irving. A floater, and it's blocked by Gilgis Alexander. Defended by Hayward. On target from 13 feet. And the Mavericks lead by four. And, and for a big man, he's as versatile as they come. I mean, he shoots it, he handles it. He's also a terrific passer. You name it, he can do it. Bangs home the trifecta. Boy, if this becomes a consistent part of Josh Giddy's game, look out because that three-point shot's going to make him so dangerous. Hardaway with it. He's picked up by Holmgren. And they're able to recover to the wing on the left. Back to Irving. Fires from deep. Gordon Hayward comes up with the rebound. I don't know if he's tired or what, but he is definitely holding back a little bit, and he has to step his game up right now. Giddy gets to Gilgis Alexander. That was foul. Daniel Gafford. First personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Thunder, Shea Gilgis Alexander. At the line for two. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Ties it up, and this next one could give them the lead. And the Mavericks with some changes. Washington comes in for Daniel Gafford. And Doncic is subbed in for Hardaway. And that one falls, and that puts him up by one point. For Dallas, they've gone three of six in the field so far in the fourth quarter. Doncic against Dort. Right wing. A shot by Washington, and he's wide open. Had the space there, but it's offline. Williams passes to Joe. No good that time. Some solid defense there from Irving. Doncic against Gilgis Alexander. Fires for three. The Mavericks keeping it alive. The new 14. Washington, that's good. And guys, here in the fourth quarter, still a close game. Instant classic, fellas. This one could come right down to the last shot. Pastor Holmgren. Back to Williams. From deep. It's rebounded by Doncic. Doncic has got six rebounds in the game. And got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Gilgis Alexander surveying the D. Pass to Joe. The shot. No good. And the Mavericks going the other way now. And on the way from Irving for three. And the three ball is good. Irving's got five points now this quarter. That's his third triple this half, and that's after hitting only one before that. The pass to Joe. From past the arc, trains the three-pointer. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. And you would expect nothing less from these two taking pride and making plays. Dallas calls timeout. Get out of your seat and on your feet for the B Town Crew. And now a moment to present the New Balance Player of the Game, Kyrie Irving. And what an amazing ball game we've seen from him. It's been a one-man show, worth the price of admission, all by itself. There wasn't anything he couldn't do 
on that court tonight. And the Mavericks making a change here. Gafford's checked in. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldrin. David. Thanks, guys. Well, I got a chance to listen in on what Jason Kidd was talking about with his players. He knows this has been a hard-fought game. And he wanted his guys to just sit down and catch their breath. He said, look, we're right in the game, guys. Let's make a little push here. Let's come out with some bite. Kevin? Okay, David, much appreciated. And it's Williams finishing it off. Good to see a player going all out when the game's this tight. You know, G.A., he knows what his job is. Patrol the offensive glass. And that's so demoralizing to your opponent. To play great defense and have the possession end that way, that's tough to take. Irving kicks to Gafford. Dort against Donchick. And it's Williams finishing it off. Gotta take care of the ball. They'll punish you if you're that careless. That's right, and that's severe punishment right there. Boy, in a tight game like this, that can change the whole tone. It helps your opponent get into a little bit of a rhythm. Fourteen foul. Doncic finds Jones. On the wing, Irving. Shot clock at six. A three. And the shooting percentage, it's taken a dip in the second half. City foul. Shane Gilgis, Alexander. Fourth personal foul. Fifteen foul. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Daniel Gaffer. Two shots. And that one falls for Gafford. And he can't hit the second. Well, a little shaky from the line, and instead of putting them in front, he's only able to tie it up. Doncic against Gilgis Alexander. On the wing, Williams. Over Jones. Oh, they get it back. Outside, Williams. Three-pointer. And again, Oklahoma City with the triple. And guys, the offensive rebounding really has stood out here this half. All those second chance points are helping them maintain that lead. Here's Irving. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Team is in the middle. Now at the line for your Mavericks. Kyrie Irving at the line for two. First free throw is good. And one of the problems in the first half, that shoddy work at the free throw line. They needed to fix that, and they've been much improved since the break. And he makes both free throws. Gilgis Alexander with it. Passes to Joe. Beyond the arc. The shot's good. Gilgis Alexander making the play. Gilgis Alexander's got assist number eight now on the night. Pass to Irving. And here is Washington. He's guarded by Williams. Yeah, it goes, and the Oklahoma City lead is cut down now to just two on the basket from Washington. And that was the right call. When you need a basket, go to the guys you trust the most. Well, you've got to earn trust, and 
and equity by making shots. Nice delivery there. Back to Gildas Alexander. Down to five on the shot clock. Williams trying to break three. The shot's good, good from Gildas Alexander. Gilgis Alexander's got 40 points. Doncic bounce back. Here's Gafford. Gafford. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Oh, big time put back there. What a great motor on this guy. There is no one who goes after those rebounds harder. Pass to Joe. And here is Williams. Three-pointer. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Doncic has got seven rebounds in the game. Two minutes remaining for the game. And it's Washington missing. Oklahoma City squad, 4 7 with the long ball here in the fourth quarter. There's Williams. And the rejection by Gafford. And that's out of bounds. It was last touched by Gafford. Oklahoma City moving the ball around. Washington against Williams. Pocket six. Back to Gilgis Alexander. There's the three. One thirty-one left here in the fourth quarter. To the paint. Holmgren with the steal. Dort with the ball. He's picked up by Doncic. They get it back. And it's still a rare sight to see rebound numbers like the ones he's had tonight. His production has been unbelievable. A testament to how much he cares about his craft. Huge shot there, and the crowd knows it. Yeah, you got to love the crowd. It's this fire. Here's Williams. It's rebounded by Dallas. And he needs to find other ways to contribute besides shooting. Sometimes you, you have to learn how to play well when you're not playing well. Short against Dungeon. Yes! So much riding on that shot. What a bucket. I'll tell you, that changes things, doesn't it? Good job, young fella. What a game. Dallas calls timeout. They're trailing by two. 44 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Left side, Irving. On the pass to Doncic. It's stolen by Dort. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's on Luka Doncic. And this is an important spot for Dort. Can he come through in the clutch for his team? Two shots. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. And this is a huge moment for Dort. Can he be the guy here for this team? And he cannot convert on the second. That misses. What you love about Lou Dort is this guy seizes an opportunity early in his career. He is always searching for ways to improve. And we know what a force he can be on the defensive end. Gilgis Alexander against Doncic. And now we've got the intentional foul. Yeah, that's right. No other option but the foul and hope for some misses. 13 foul. At the line for the Thunder. Shade Gilgis Alexander. Two shots. the first one and that gives them a four point cushion and we've seen SGA blossom into a number one option another chance here to prove himself and so both free throws are good 
and it's a five-point game. That's what you call slamming the door. This one is over. Dallas calls timeout. They're behind by five. There's 14 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Guys, your thoughts? No time to waste here. Quick bucket and a foul. Everybody has got to be in the exact perfect position defensively, and execution has got to be on point. There's 14 seconds left in the game. Jones, that's for two. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Daniel no Gafford. choice but to foul there, buddy. But he's probably the last foul. guy you want to see on the line. Shooting for Oklahoma City. Isaiah Joe at the line for two. And the first of two, no good, heartbreaking. And no good on the second free throw, so he goes 0 for 2 there. And a deep three from Doncic. Knocks down the trifecta. And so Mark Dagnall calls a timeout. So a close game sees Oklahoma City taking this That's one. The end of the game. I think, Greg, they played with a little more you know, up relaxed and demeanor tonight, tonight, knowing this we was it, now or we never. And, and see you their again. season Peace. continues because of that, Kevin. How about forcing a Game 7? This is big, and it's going to be an intense battle. I cannot wait.